Juice Crew, are you ready to spit the lyrics, the whole lyrics, and nothing but the lyrics, and kill this beat with your bars? Step into the booth then. You're up to bat. All right, you face famous spawns. You already know. If I got the Kangol on, we back in the 80s. I got a special treat for you guys. I got the Symphony, Cool G Rap, Big Daddy Kane, Marley Marl, Master Ace. We about to get it. All right, y'all ready for this? Look his leg. Take it from me. This song made rap history. It has changed the course of rap. You have no idea what this song has done for hip hop. You have no idea. This song is from one of the greatest crew, the Juice Crew. And to be in the Juice Crew is an honor. All right, so, hey, let's get it. Now, remember, we're going with a Western thing. The bad guys are coming, okay? So, we're going to be in the cowboy uniforms and all that stuff coming up. Western theme going on, so, you know, it's a nice visual. Nice production. I like the way they did it. I like the way they came through with this. We're taking over the rap game. That's basically what they're saying. The saloon is like a metaphor of the house of rap. These guys are coming in to take over that house of rap. So just look at the house of rap. You got the rappers in there chasing after chicks, trying to get some. You know, you got the other MCs getting thrown out the saloon. Like, man, you ain't good enough. Get the hell out of here. Fuck on. This is what we about. We we in this. Not tonight. Face famous sighting. That's Marley Marl. That's who produced this beat. That's who made this. Now, a little side note, Marley Marl actually made another symphony with Big Daddy Kane's brother in it, Lil Daddy Shane, which I'll react to as well. Um, Big Daddy Kane also makes an appearance in this song, but he's cut out because I think his brother was in jail at the time they made this. So you're going to see a different scenery when Big Daddy Kane do come on. Another side note. About uh, six bars of Master Ace's verse got cut out in this video. But if you dig up on YouTube or if you already have it, if you know this song, then you know the last part of his verse, the last six bars. So I'm just letting you know, if it seemed like Master Ace stuff got cut off abruptly because it did, there's about six bars missing out of his. Master Ace. Anybody remember Master Ace? Um, he came out with the yellow tape. Uh, got Saturday Night Live on it. It has Jeep Ass Nigga on it. It has Slaughterhouse on it. It was a Slaughterhouse before Eminem Slaughterhouse. It was his crew, Slaughterhouse. Um, the yellow tape, I had it. Matter of fact, I still rock that thing. But now that we got YouTube and technology, I can just download Master Ace's stuff. But Master Ace had a yellow tape. Master Ace, a very underrated MC. This dude right here, Cool G Rap, the most famous Mike Tyson sounding rapper ever with the lists and the lists. But he's a very multi syllable rhymer and he it just fits him. You hear Cool G Rap and he's still active today. That man's a legend. Now, DJ Polo, so we go back a little bit. This dude right here, DJ Polo, that's Cool G Rap's boy. DJ Polo, that's Cool G Rap and DJ Polo. He's going wherever he go. Who last, but I know 
know that y'all just better rock this at the drop of a dime, baby. One of the world's most famous introductions ever. This is almost like a cipher just put on video. That introduction right there. This is where come in and display your skills. Come in and let me know what you got. Rock this at the drop of a dime, baby. But it got to be funky. It got to be funky if you're going to be on it. I don't care who start. I don't care what y'all do. But you got to be finished before the music is through. Now, who's first up to bat? Listen closely to your attentions under fire. He straight up got punk. Listen closely to your attention under fire. He just straight yanked that dude. Just straight up finger flex move. Many in the past have tried to do what I did. Not just the way I came off then, I'm going to come off. Stronger and longer, even with the drum. Look how he just looked the dude up and down. Look how dude back and down off of him. He just looking him up and down like, nigga, you ain't shit. The fuck you gonna do? What? This? What? Yeah. I'll keep on going and flowing just like a river. I got a whole lot to give, so I'm a giver. A little at a time, new trails I'm blazing. Action is and took his strap in his face. You didn't get your own gun pointed at you. What? In effect, it always stays in. Yeah, just like a shot from a cannon. I am the man in charge, and I'm the planet. A jam strong enough that it can lift your soul. I'm the originator, and my rhymes are made of gold. Once you hear the capital A, rap it. See, that's back then. It wasn't it was bar heavy. Bar heavy. There's a difference between how you spit the bars then, now. Bar heavy. Even still, my bars made a goal. The emphasis in there. Once you hear the capital A, rap it'll stay. With you for a while, it won't go away unless you force it. Of course, it stays with you, my friend. And if you force it away, I'ma hit you again. I believe. So right there. About eight bars, six to eight bars got cut off. Cause like I said, it ends abruptly. You know, I'ma hit you again. So I don't know what happened with the video. Maybe he couldn't finish it for whatever reason. He needed room to get Big Daddy Kane in, but they they cut itself off. I project my voice so it's right in the crowd. There's a sign at the door, no biting allowed. And if you didn't read, I suggest you do so. You'd be stranded just like Caruso once to give it after the bit. You know, uh, I forgot the rest, but. Just missing that part. It feels a little incomplete in the video. I believe that's me. Craig G, light up the mic for the symphony. The gym is dedicated to all unoptimistic. That thought I wasn't coming out with some exquisite rhymes. But that's all right, because now I'm back to kill all the rumors and straighten the facts of me. Not rocking rhymes like I always used to, but you jumped on the tip when you heard me in the juice cruise. You said, mm-mm-mm. Now, there's a thing about that. When he said, but you jumped on my tip when you heard us in the Juice Crew, that's a subliminal to another crew. And I think it was KRS once, it was Boogie Down Productions, but there was Juice Crew. And I can't remember the name of that other crew. Uh, shoot. Hold on, let me see. Let me find out who Juice Crew is beefing with. Bear with me. Let me look it up. Yep. It was Juice Crew versus BDP, Boogie Down Productions. It's Koji Rap. I mean, not Koji I'm sorry. KRS One. So, yeah, I was correct. Ain't that something? Look like I heard you in that jam and it's pumping. I apologize. Oh, yeah, and uh, can I have your autograph for me and my grandma? That's how I'm living. On surprise mode. Don't even sleep. So he's letting them know. Yeah, you heard I was in a Juice Crew. Now you want my autographs? Oh, I'm hot now, huh? What about then? But now with the Juice Crew. The Juice Crew would... People fought to get in the Juice Crew. You damn near had an audition to get in that group. So he took his spot, took his chick. So Craig G ain't playing. He was like, hey, you slept on me. That's what you get for sleeping. The Mike Tyson of rap, Cool G rap, the lips. Yo, Marley Kibbs a 
slice. I get nice in my voice. It's twice as hard to find as this in price. Go steep till you fell in a spell of a sleep. And while I'm counting the money, you count sheep. When G rap strikes the mic, I recite the type, the height that you like to make the people unite. I rip off hips and zip off lips. Step on reps. You flip and want to sip on my tip. Take a deep. Cool G rap's a monster. I don't care. Kooji Rap's always going to be on my list, no matter what. There's nothing you can do to take him off. Kooji Rap stays on my list. He, dude, is a monster. He's the Mike Tyson of hip hop. On my tip, take a deep breath because you don't have enough of left. Coming back like I'm avenging my brother's death. Make your veterans run for medicine because I put out more life in a fight the Con Edison. Rip the damn cage like I'm on a rampage. So if you want rage, I'm going to make fun. And then a lot of y'all, you don't know who Vincent Price is. He was in a lot of horror movies. He commentated and narrated some horror movies. He has a very unique, distinct voice. It's every Halloween, you're going to hear Vincent Price's voice. I'm just let you know that now. He's still alive. He's like 82, 83 years old right now. But Vincent Price, you'll hear him. There was him. There was Elvira, Mistress of Darkness, Elvira. Beautiful woman. And she did horror films and comedy as well, just like Vincent Price. So that's why he's saying, I'm a monster. I'm, I'm a, my voice twice as horrifying as Vincent Price, don't sleep. So he's basically saying, many of you hear my voice, you're going to be terrified because you know it's me. So I think they cut out some of Cool G raps too, just for the video purposes. Like I said, to get Big Daddy Kane in here. So that's why it kind of ends abruptly. If you notice the background, they're on screen and he's in modern day clothing so they kind of had to make do because they couldn't get little daddy shane on there but either way you go can't kill the two and what y'all don't know big daddy came out with raw smooth operator ain't no half stepping uh wrath of kane He's a beast. The dude was not to be messed with. Plus, he danced in his videos. So all this pre-puffy stuff. Kane rapped it and danced it. And was still good. We didn't even care about dancing. But back then, the 80s, 90s, we danced. We kicked it. We had some fun. We wasn't no hugging the wall and all of that crap like they're doing now. Like I said, this video is legendary. You saying that you can all claim because rocking the party is a small thing. Man, it ain't nothing. Put me in front of a mic. It's it's a rap. Party, concert, psh, it's whatever. It's this. It ain't nothing to me. The mark left that you can all claim. Rockin' a party, yo, it's a small thing I've written many places on regular basis And broken down mics were the only traces That I've been there So he even saying And broken down mics was the only traces That I've been there and there at the party Kane is a beast I've written many places on regular basis And broken down mics were the only traces That I've been there and there at the party The mic had my prints and on it was a party I'm not forcing around in a throwdown clown. I'm taking your son. So just acknowledge the way that I kicked it because a rap was a house. You be evicted. So he's even saying, just acknowledge how I put it down. Because a rap was a house, you be evicted. Like I said, the saloon is the metaphor of the house. You see people getting thrown out, getting put out, getting put down, getting parked in front of their girls, getting their girls taken. That's why he said, if rap was a house, you be evicted. So. Hmm, I don't know. There's a certain somebody on YouTube that be going on Vlad TV talking about a house of hip hop and Eminem. God, would that be? I can't remember his name, Lord Jamar. Somebody very irrelevant used to be in a very famous group, but now talks a lot of shit about him in the house of hip hop. I don't know. Even though M admits he is a guest, but if it wasn't for these dudes right here, if it wasn't for Juice Crew, there'd be no house of hip hop. And dismissed from the microphone, choking on a bone, his daddy's home, home. and battling me, his hazardous to help. So put a quarter in your act, but you played yourself. So I'm 
brain superior, always taking care of you. No frill rappers, you will evaporate the center. So you see how modern day clothes they're wearing right here compared to the rest of the group. So that's why I'm saying Big Daddy came, probably came on late to get this done, but he brought his crew with him. So it, it still got done. He still killed this no matter what. Always taking care of you. No frill rappers. You will evaporate the center. Great, great, great to your face. And the great will dominate my nation. Straight to the state. Oh, raining, raining, raining. I love that confidence, just how he's standing there. This, I own this. This is mine. I own all of this. What? What? Please. My name, my name, straight to the state. Oh, raining, 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 raining. That category, period, in the storm. And I'm just sitting here noticing, now I'm sitting here looking at it. The high top fades. Oh my God, that was a style. High top. High top. That right there, that the perm for the females, the skull cap. Tango. I mean, hey. The rope chains. Look at it. The the right there, the ah uh, the knuckle rings. Status. Yo, right there, just letting y'all know that was my favorite. That I love that song. Leave a like, leave a comment. Freeze, please, please, please press subscribe if you like my content. Other than that, let me know in the comment section anything else you want me to react to, break down lyrically, because I, like I said, bar for bar, I'm breaking it down. Face famous spawns. Wherever you go, there you are. Just like Call of Duty, you die, you pop up somewhere else. So wherever you're at, you're there, you're there. All right, my spawns, let me know what you think. We all in this together. Let's grow this channel. Give me some more. Like I said, I'm going from 80s, 90s, 2000s, even present. I'm going back and forth. We're breaking them all down. Like I said, you see me with the can go along, you know we in the 80s. So, hey, let's get it. Until next time, I'm out.